94.9 The Surf Chef oh, Willie, oh. wrapping up our Surf Time Castle for the year 1958. Well, for the past, well, since the last year, we have been talking about the Ocean Drive Beach Music Festival, award-winning festival its first two years. And how do you top that? You bring in Delbert McClinton. Ladies and gentlemen, live here in the studio with us right now, the one, the only, Delbert McClinton. Delbert, good morning. Hey, man, how you doing? Oh, man, it's so good to have you back here. I was just telling Delbert uh, a little while ago, I got an email earlier this morning. You were uh, you were in D.C. last night. Right, yeah. And uh, a guy called me up, and he heard us talking about it, and he says, uh, you're going to love the show. He was on, on there singing. The band was tight. He said he sounded. He had so much energy like it was 20 years ago. And I was like, I know, I cannot wait. It's actually been 20 years since I've seen you, so I can't wait. Well, tonight, uh, tomorrow night's tonight. And uh, we're going to have perfect weather for this, by the way. Well, you know, we, we play so many of your songs all the time, and I love to tell the story. Uh, I actually got on your tour bus. This was 25 years ago. You had play, you were playing here in North Myrtle. And after the show, uh, my buddy Danny Lockamy, you may remember yeah, Danny, yeah. and uh, he got us back there. And I, I wanted to find out for sure because we didn't have the Internet in those days. And I said, is it true, the story? Uh-huh. About you play, uh, teaching uh, John Lennon some some licks on the harmonica, and you said it absolutely is. And uh, I've, I've said that so many times now, I don't think it's a surprise to anybody now. Well, you know, that it, that's a good story, but, you know, those kind of things get romanticized a great deal. Mm-hmm. Uh, in, in 1962 or one, well, I don't even remember when it was. 61. Uh, 61 or two, uh, Hey Baby. Yeah. By Bruce Chanel. I played harmonica on it. When, when Bruce got booked to play the British Isles, he told him, he says, well, I'm, I'm not going to do it unless I can have a harmonica player with me. Isn't that right? Well, that's a, it's a big part of the song. big part of the song. So I got to go with him, and the Beatles were the opening act on a couple of the shows we did. And uh, John and I hung out a little bit, and... Uh, I love that. The Beatles were the opening act. It's <laughs> great to be able to say that. I tell you, but what a career you've had. I mean, you've worked with so many legends. I mean, I'm not even talking about the Beatles. I'm talking about all through your Bonnie Raitt and, and just about everybody who's anybody you've worked with, you've written songs with, you've done concerts with. It's an amazing career, and you're still going strong. Well, I can't stop. <laughs> Obviously, you still love it. I do love it. Uh, it's, uh, it's, it's, it's what makes, makes everything work for me. I love to do this. Now, uh, Mike uh, broke the news this week. I was unaware, and I got really excited that you have a new album coming out. That's right, coming out uh, June twenty. June? I mean, yeah, July, July, of July twenty six. We'll have it on but, here the first but, day. Well, sometime this month they're going to release the first single. Okay, which uh, they're going to release three of them before the album comes out, and uh, people can buy them. Bam. Right you know, uh, push I, a button and buy the same. Yeah, and everything's so quick nowadays. Yes, it is. It's, uh, it's as soon as I heard the news, I ran out on the internet trying to find a track listing and couldn't find anything about it. So, what's this? What's this album going to be like? Well, this is uh, uh, a bit of uh, it's going to be. It's great. <laughs> all, think, all original songs. Or uh, all original. Covers? All original songs, and uh, I think it's going to. I think it's going to be uh, a surprise to some people. We. I, I did a little bit of uh, reinvention of myself. Oh, really? Yeah. Well, I cannot wait to hear it. Cannot wait to hear the, the first three singles as well. We'll get them on the air the second we get them, I promise you folks. We're talking with Delbert McClinton, who's going to be here part of the Ocean Drive Beach Music Festival tomorrow. Gates open up at 10. Jim Quick and Coastline are going to start up at about uh, 12. Jimmy Hall. We're going to talk about Jimmy a little bit. Jimmy Hall's going to be at 2, and then Delbert will hit the stage sometime after Jimmy. It should be a little bit after 4. Have you ever worked with Jimmy Hall before? Jimmy's been on my cruise for the last 26 years, 26 25 years. years. 25, that's amazing. Yeah, he, uh, like he, I said, he's worked with everybody in the business, too. Oh, he has. Well, Jimmy's the best black soul singer alive, period. That's pretty impressive coming from you. Well, he is, you know, and uh, he's badass. Well, you know, we, we play some of his songs. He hasn't had as, as many chart hits, but it's amazing if you if you knew who everybody he worked with. Uh, he's still working with, with major, major artists here today. So to have him and you here together uh, in the same show, it's, it's a very rare opportunity, and I'm really excited about it. Well, it'll be fun because Jimmy's show is always uh, full tilt. You know, he's uh, he can't he can't do anything but powerhouse. Yeah. Well, I, I say he can't do anything, even if he's doing a ballad. He's just he's got he's got that voice. He's Jimmy Hall. 
How about that? I cannot wait for tomorrow. And we, we were watching the weather all week long. We might get some showers that are coming up the coast today, but tomorrow we're going to be fine. Uh, we're going to be outdoors right next to the legendary OD Pavilion, the third annual Ocean Drive Beach Music Festival. We do still have a few tickets on sale. You can pick them up here at the OD Resort, or you can visit the website for more information, odmusicfest.com, with the legendary Delbert McClinton. I cannot wait for this, Delbert. We appreciate you coming in and talking with Hi, us Hey, man, morning. it's my pleasure. Thank you for having me. Well, it's always an honor. Anytime we get a chance to get Delbert in the studio, are you kidding me? Thanks so much for coming by. My pleasure. Thank